Right, welcome back to Dick Small Engine. It's a bit of an update on the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Husqvarna K760 unit. Um, I've rebuilt the car for the second time now. Um, no metering lever this time. Uh, initially, sorry, it was a diaphragm and gasket case. Rebuilt. Couldn't get as far as you saw. Um, this occasion of fitted a new uh, needle. Uh, spring and needle and metering lever. Now we have had it firing, uh, it's fired, but it won't run. So machine's now back on the bench. I wanna show you what I've been, um, what I've been um, up to on this strip down occasion. Uh, like I say, it's fired, but won't run now. Um, so again, units down in bits. Uh, I've had the floor wheel off, I've had the, the floor wheel key on these um, machines, log. A few two strokes I've encountered. Um, the floor wheel key is actually fixed to the crank itself, um, so that's in good order, as I already know. Um, I've had these spring loaded pulls off, they are absolutely fine. Floor wheel and clutch is fine, so timing is not an issue. Um, I, I spoke about um, a top end rebuild, but I've decided against that for the simple fact um, I'm getting well in excess of 100 psi following a compression test. So I know the the piston and the bore, despite what the endo, endoscope picked up uh, in the last video, um, the scoring is it was negligible um, because of the compression readings I'm getting. Um, so timing's good, compression's good, coil is good, I'm, I'm getting um, a resistance reading of about 1500, now I have looked on online forums and that, um, I'm not entirely sure what a good spec is on this coil, so if anyone knows please drop it in the comments section, um, but I am I am getting a spark and I am getting a, about 1500 uh, Ohms uh, f following a multimeter test, but um, so what I'm as you can see, the machine's in bits, all the all the ports are clear, uh, like I say, the ball, um, exhaust is clear. So it's a case of rebuilding this now, and I think the plan of action is, um, to order a genuine new carb which i've seen online about 27 quid um so at some point when i've rebuilt this machine with a melee of t27 uh torx bolts um i'm going to order a new carb at some point and then we'll go for a fire up um don't know when that will be because i haven't ordered it yet um so stay tuned this machine will be up and running fortunately it's one of my own uh, in a backlog that I've had over the years that I'm working my way through. Uh, so there's no immediate rush. I've got a lot of other machines coming now, uh, customers and me own, which are gonna take priority over this. This isn't priority, but this machine will be up and running. So stay tuned. Right, K760 unit now built. As far as I can uh, go until I order this new carb and get that new carb fitted now. It's, it's a mystery uh, two-stroke carb for me. Um, as I say, I've rebuilt this twice. Um, as I mentioned, no metering lever, uh, spring needle, diaphragm and gasket set. Um, in hindsight, for the for the uh, issues I've encountered, I mean, I've got it to fire, but I can't get it to run. I'm believing it to be a fuel issue. Um, uh, Got good compression over 100 psi like i mentioned um got spark a bit of a query on the call as i mentioned a short while ago um but i'm going to order see the existing car but i've left the boot on and the um, bottom of the air filter assembly so it's going to be a case of no cardboard and get that fitted on and we'll get this We'll get this uh, Husqvarna K760 unit fired and hopefully up and running. Don't know when.
bit of an update video, a bit of a quick update video. Um, so, this machine will be up and running. Um, as my motto goes, quitters never win, winners never quit. Um, so, in the not too distant future, when I get this car boarded at some point, um, we'll have her up and running, I have no doubt. So, if you like this video, give us a like, feel free to subscribe. Check out the Dick Small Engine Amazon wish list that I'll have towards a go from your channel. Um, leave any comments down in the comment section. And until the next one, take care. Ta-da for now.